Alright. So, a dramatic hour of Barong. Hospitality, you and no one else. And I came here intending to offer you all the hospitality I can possibly muster in honor of this most suspicious of holidays. So, what do you think of the view from this hotel? You are on the top floor, after all, a true penthouse suite. All of Tokyo is visible before you at a mere glance. I so dearly wanted you to see it with your own eyes. Expensive? <laughs> There's no need to worry about the coin. Whatever you can afford, I'm sure we can make arrangements to take care of the part-time work. Wait, what do you mean part-time work? Now, allow me to take your luggage, and I'll show you to your... What's this, Brad? <laughs> a present for me! Well, now, this is a surprise, but certainly a welcome one. I'm most pleased. You enjoy this Valentine's event to the utmost as well, don't you? I do so appreciate a lovely guest with a get-up-and-go attitude. It makes me inclined to serve you with renewed vigor. You will come to see the special dance show tonight, won't you? prepared a front row seat for you. Not just any seat either, but a table seat with complimentary dinner. I certainly hope you'll be looking forward to it. Kisses. Oh, wow. Time for me to dance the night away, and you get a special box seat from which to enjoy it. May your every wish be fulfilled here, my precious, lovely VIP guest. Whoa! Um. Whoa. <laughs> and whilst I dance, allow me to regale you with a tale from long ago. In my homeland, was once a starving traveler, a noble who should have risen to the very top of the world's hierarchy. All the beasts of the world came to greet and offer hospitality to this traveler, all but one rabbit who had nothing to give. So the rabbit leaped into a flame, and its body should become its offering. Say the word. I want to hear you say I brought you unparalleled enjoyment, that my taste is a cut above all others.
wow. I mean, it's hard for it's hard for me to to see him as a jerk. 